Hey everybody, welcome to Home Preschool Fun with Sara. Today I'm sharing a beautiful story from Holy Quran and that's about one of his prophets. Prophet Yunus alayhi salam. Yes, I'm sharing his story today. The story name is Prophet Yunus alayhi salam in the whale's belly. How did Prophet Yunus salam get into whale's belly? Let's find out. That's whale's stomach. Prophet Yunus salam in the whale's belly. Many centuries ago, Prophet Yunus salam was born in Jerusalem. He was a holy man. He took interest in the welfare of people. One day, Allah ordered him to go to the city of Nineveh to guide the cruel people. As you can see, this is the map and this highlighted point is Nineveh where Hazrat Yunus salam was sent. Prophet Yunus salam preached at Nineveh, but it was all useless. The wicked people of Nineveh kept on following their evil ways. Whenever Prophet Yunus salam asked them to practice good behavior, they showed hatred towards him. Yunus salam told them, You should believe only in Allah. And obey him. You should worship him alone and do good. Otherwise, a harsh punishment will come upon you. Prophet Yunus salam delivered sermon after sermon, but no change was visible in the cruel people of Nineveh. Prophet Yunus salam was growing worried and irritated day by day. That's really sad. Yunus salam soon discovered that the people did not want to listen to him. He lost patience and left the town in anger. Yunus salam decided to go across the sea by a ship. But when the ship was in the middle of the ocean, Yunus salam suffered a great misfortune. He was thrown from the ship and swallowed by a whale. You know what misfortune is? It's a bad luck, a difficulty. Oh my goodness, that's the wheel's stomach. Huge. It was very dark inside the wheel's stomach. Yunus salam grew very fearful. In his loneliness, he started to think over what had happened in the town. Then he realized that he should not have acted in such an angry manner. Instead, he should have stayed and kept on guiding his people. Yunus salam started praying. He said, O oh Allah, there is no God apart from you. You alone do I praise and honor. I have done wrong. If you do not help me, I shall be lost forever. Allah accepted his prayer. Prayers are always heard, you know. The whale came up on the surface again and swam towards the shore. It threw out Prophet Yunus salam.
Yunus al-Salam was still alive. He found himself in a strange and lonely place. He was very ill. Allah ordered a tree to grow nearby. The tree provided Yunus al-Salam with shade and fruits. Gradually, his strength came back and he found his way to his hometown, Ninue. And you know what? He was surprised to notice the change that had taken place there. The entire population came out to welcome him. They informed him that now they believed in Allah. Hmm, that's a good change. And then, you know what happened? Together they prayed and thanked Allah. Prophet Yunus Salam started preaching once again. And this time, his people followed his teachings. Well, that was a wonderful story from Holy Quran. And I hope you all have liked it. One thing I want to share here, that we must and keep on praying from Allah. Because prayers are always heard. I'll see you next time. Till then, take care. Bye.